Well, the TV finally went out, y'all. <laughs> it's been, what, two years? You can hear it? But you can't. You can't see nothing. So, yeah. Two years, man. It's been a good little two years, and this thing gone, man. So, yeah, here's the update. Well, the TV, I don't know. I think it's about to go out, but it was not, shut up. It was not cutting on at all. Like, it wasn't showing as you guys saw. But what I did to fix the issue, I unplugged every every cable off my TV, all my HD and my cords. I took them completely off. I unplugged my TV. I kept doing that repeatedly, but it didn't work unplugging it. So I had unplugged it and then took out my um, HD and my cables. And I waited a little bit, cut it back on, and it powered up. So hopefully they'll help you guys if y'all having this issue with this on Roku TV. But to keep speaking on this issue, it's been two years since I had this TV. So I have noticed a couple of things that's changing with this TV. Like, as you guys saw how the screen turned off, it's been doing that lately. That's why I'm thinking maybe this TV is actually about to go out. Because sometimes I power it off, and then when I wake up in the morning, turn it back on, I get the black screen. And I haven't reset the whole thing yet, so I'm trying to avoid avoid it right now. But this is what's been going on with this TV two years. And it just started maybe two or three months ago, so it's been two years and a couple of months. Well, two years and a month, I'm sorry, because I got in um, last November. So, yeah, it's been a two years and a month, and this is some of the things that's been going on with it. Black screen and not wanting the power on. As you can see, it really didn't come on for a good little minute. So, And you've seen the static in the TV as well. That made me think, too, like, dang, you know, this TV about to go out. But this is my update for you guys. So I finally reset the TV yesterday. It was doing well. Then when I came back home, cut the TV back on, I got another black screen. So resetting the TV does not fix the issue. I did a whole factory reset. Didn't work. It still works. It just sometimes when you power it on, you're going to get the black screen. You got to unplug it and plug it back in. So just want to give you guys another update if you're watching this video. It's gladly is working right now, but. I'm pretty sure when I try to cut it back on again, it's not going to work after a couple hours. So new TV it is.